Objects for us designers are very important because they kind of um, allow us to communicate very well um, what is our intention and to keep this intention all along the project. You know, projects are pretty long, and uh, so to keep the original idea is very important because so many things happen that you can lose your project in your mind, so it's very important to keep that as, as that. So, for example, this one, um, which is a shark fin, was actually kind of an idea which was in Randy Rodriguez's concept about the 370Z. And he had actually looked at a, a, a very uh, a passionate documentary on sharks. And that's uh, when he wanted to uh, have that sort of sleek shape that goes into the, the water um, as a metaphor for a sleek shape that goes into the air on the 370Z. This one is uh, the earth and it's uh, a, an object that is in, in levitation and that is for the uh, no gravity seats. Uh, the seats actually have been created for the new um, uh, Altima and uh, these seats are supposed to be um, giving you the same feeling as if you were in outer space with no gravity. This one is uh, kind of my favorite. Uh, it's a, a bulldog with sunglasses, with shades. And um, the idea is, th is that when uh, uh, the group that was working on the cube was uh, looking for, for an image that would represent this kind of unusual silhouette, uh, they looked at this one as being uh, uh, you know, very planted, like bulldogs are, uh, so something very solid looking. But at the same time, the fascia reminded them of, of shades, so that's why this image of a bulldog with the um, sunshades uh, re retained. These windmills are for the project that was Resonance, and Resonance is, uh, was a show car that was supposed to express all the uh, um, most advanced technologies, and we tried to use um, you know, composites that were new, uh, uh, shapes that were really expressing the fluidity, but at the same time um, with, uh, with uh, everything very modern and very high-tech about them. And then lastly, we have a motorcycle tank. So this one is not the exact shape, but uh, it's, uh, it's red as it is in, in the car. So the Duke is a car that we wanted to have an interior that was a little bit different. And uh, the instrument panel is a classical instrument panel with, with floating gauges. Uh, but what's really cool about the, the center console, which is usually, usually a leftover um, part, which is very uh, practically or oriented uh, with uh, uh, parts that are not so interesting. Uh, this one is painted with body color um, and it's also uh, something that has a shape that um, lets your um, knee rest against that and, and that that's what gives the, the character of the interior of Duke. The objects, uh, we uh, basically have to look for them and, and, and find them wherever, so the internet, any shop. We work mostly on images, but to work like this in 3D by gathering objects and putting them in, in boxes or in a meaningful way is, is really unique to Nissan as, as far as I know.